Hey guys, so today we're gonna go harvest the buffer oats that are around the field. These buffer oats serve two purposes. One, it serves as a place for us to turn around in the field because we make like five to 10 passes a year throughout the field. So we have to turn around on the end and that when we turn it tears up the crops. So you could plant regular crops like we did with this bean field. We actually planted beans on the ends, but you have to turn very carefully. You have to try to not turn really sharp and tear the crops out. With oats, you just kind of turn. It doesn't really matter. You can tear them out, whatever. And two, they also serve as a border between the neighbor fields because the neighbors are conventional. And since they spray, the spray, drip, spray possibly drifts little bit maybe so we have to have a 30 to 50 foot border between the conventional neighbors and then we can just sell these oats to a conventional market whoever wants them you can just sell we sell them to a guy who has horses i believe and he just feeds the horses the oats so yeah they serve a couple purposes but we're gonna go harvest them this afternoon and there's not too many so we'll hopefully get it done early sometime this afternoon oats harvested at this plate at this farm well there's not that many oats since the grass kind of took over the oats but anyway we're gonna go to the Mauer farm we're going to cut the oats there then head to the Danker farm but what we're gonna do is some of the oats are organic and then some of the oats might possibly be sprayed so we'll harvest the oats that are supposed to be organic and then we'll go at the Mauer farm then we'll go to Danker farm harvest those oats come back to the Mauer farm and then we'll harvest the convention the sprayed oats and then come back and harvest a little bit of sprayed oats here at the home farm so it'll be it's already 5 30 so it'll probably be pretty late by the time we get back home so hopefully we can see what we're doing while harvesting the oats
Turns out the combine doesn't like going crossways through a ditch. Who would have thought? Mine, it'll spread it right throughout the field and then you'll have a problem.
So Dad went on and he's gonna go grab the buffer on the west side of this field. Then he's gonna do the buffer along the south side of that bean field. And then he's gonna come up and he'll probably dump into the wagon and then we'll see what else we can do tonight. We might unhook the head. We'll just have to see what happens. So yeah. Okay guys, so now we're gonna put the organic oats into the bin and then we'll keep the conventional oats in the wagon.